Hello everyone and welcome to episode 3 of Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Randomizer Seed 1. So last episode I went through Dodongo's Cavern. I didn't finish it, but I did go through it all the way up to the point where uh, I stepped on the switch to make that first platform rise so we could get up to that uh, platform a lot more quicker. And I am also not going to be beating uh, Dudongo's Cavern for quite some time. Because I really want to explore to see the possible things that I can get. I did get the Bolero of Fire last episode, but I don't have the Ocarina. So I can't play that right now. Here we are in the majestic... Uh, the majestic Goron City. The place to uh, relieve yourself from the troubles you are having. Oh, wait. There's not really anything I can get there. Uh, you may also recall last time my shield burnt because, you know, I was in that room with those bats. Yeah, I had the Deku shield and I wasn't able to get out in time before the bats hit the, the shield. It, it was probably for the best that, you know, it probably would have been better if I actually went in with the, uh, you know, with the Hylian shield instead of the Deku shield. But I thought that maybe I could get it. It, it just turned out that I was wrong. You know, I could have actually come here at night. Oh well. I really don't have time to uh, go and uh, make it nighttime. But anyway, I am going to go ahead and buy the Hylian Shield, since I will need that. And also going to, oh wait a minute, I can't, I can't buy those. Is there anything I can buy for 19 rupees? Let's see, we already got plenty of the Skulchulas last episode. That rupee is gone. I guess it's a one-time thing. I thought that it would uh, respawn, but I guess it doesn't. I guess you only get it once. All right, so I have the Hylian shield equipped. Not quite sure what I could do at this point. I really don't want to return to the Deku tree just yet. But I'm not quite sure exactly what I could do, uh, you know, at this point. You know, I think that the only things I can do at this point, you know, considering that the the gate at Death Mountain is probably closed off, so I won't be able to enter Kakariko Village just yet, I think that the best thing to do is just finish up the first two dungeons of the game, since I can do that. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go inside of the Deku tree and get as far as I can to beating Goma. Sure hope the music doesn't glitch out like it did in the first episode. You know, if I had Din's fire, that would make Ah, oh, dang it. I pushed the wrong button. I hate when I do that. What I was trying to do is get Link to attack with the Deku stick. But hopefully I will uh, push the right button this time. Okay, it is the D button. Oh, wait. Actually, I didn't need to push a button. And my, di my shield. Uh... Okay. Ah, oh, dang it! That was my only shot! Oh! Oh, thank goodness I got... I put... I keep pressing the wrong buttons! I... I keep going into view mode when I don't want to! Okay. Come on. Uh... Can you even beat him with the, uh, the slingshot? Ah! 
Dang, that was my only bomb. I pushed the wrong buttons again! Wait, do I even need to beat him, actually? Oh, ooh. I got the slingshot out again when I didn't mean to. Ah, I keep pushing the wrong buttons. All right, come on, please. Get it. There's no place for me to go. Okay, there we go. All right, just gotta get through there quickly. Yeah, I suppose you don't really need to, uh, to beat them in order to get through. I thought maybe, okay. Now to dive underneath the water. Lower the water. Now to get on top of the this platform here before it goes away. All right, made it. You know, I kind of wish that in the normal game. Uh, oh, I, oh, I've also noticed that, uh, that pushing the block has been sped up. Yeah, it usually goes a lot slower than it did. Thank goodness for that. Okay. I don't think I need to bother with, uh, hitting the Deku Bubba's. Dead for the count. Yeah, yeah, normally you wouldn't have the bomb bag in order to blow up that wall, but you also need to have the boomerang in order to get the gold sculpture that's in there, and normally you would not have that. And I don't have it this time. I mean, if I was lucky enough to have found it earlier on, I probably could have gotten it, but... I didn't find it, and I don't even know how soon in the game before we do actually find it. I think the music is starting to fail. No, I don't want to get on top of the box. I want to grab it. All right, now to light the, the Deku stick and... Fall down. Okay. And thankfully I got... Oh, man. <sighs> you know, I don't think I can get these guys just yet. Because I think I need to have the Deku shield. And, you know, I lost that in the last episode. Wish I hadn't, but I did. So I think I'll actually come back uh, after I've gotten the new uh, Deku uh, shield. So... BRB. I am back, and now I have a new Deku shield. All right. Oh, not that. Put it away. All right, this one first. Hopefully, hopefully the code has not been randomized. I have not randomized the code, by the way. At least I don't think I have. Oh, well, we'll have to come back here eventually. See? Alright, so now we can enter the boss. Well, the boss room. Oh, you don't even have to look up in the randomizer. I wonder what the music for the boss is going to be. What? The Deku Tree music is the boss for go- I mean, the- the boss music. Okay, uh... 
I am uh, getting things all set up for this fight. Oh, just gotta remember what buttons to press. Oh, I, I didn't mean to press that. Oh, all right, this time, this time, this time. No, dang it, only one shot. All right, well, she's climbing up. All right, and before she lays her eggs, gotta fire. Oh, I, I thought maybe I could uh, just keep attacking before she got up. So, she's climbing back up. And I'm gonna have to shoot her in the eye again. All right. And a single hit on the big spider and she is down. Yeah, a pretty quick fight. Well, maybe not so when you play the game for the first time. Oh, and we get yet another gold Skulltula token. Well, at least, uh... At least now, we'll be able to get whatever reward uh, you get for uh, getting 10 gold Skulltula tokens is. As soon as we, uh, get to, uh... Kakariko Village. Okay. So... The spirit medallion was put in place of the the Kakiri Emerald. By the way, is that Know It All Brother? No, he's moved out of the way. I thought that he would move out of the way uh, for getting the Kakiri Emerald, but not for uh, beating the Deku Tree. All right, so now I got the Fairy Ocarina. Oh. <laughs> I I didn't realize that I uh, had had that thing in the corner where. You... What are the buttons for that? Oh, there we go. It was the uh, the number buttons all the way over here. Oh, hold on. Uh, yeah, I'm just ch figuring this out. Okay, let's see. All right, I played Sarah's song, but we don't have that in our inventory yet. But the the one song that we do have in our inventory is the Bolero of Fire. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Okay, there we go. And I think that the pitch for the mu the ocarina is different. All right, so that was just a test. Now I'm gonna re-enter Kikiri Forest so we can get that uh, gold sculptula. Yeah, the uh, the icon up at the uh, at the at the screen where the ocarina is that's apparently a feature that makes it so that you can. Put Equip the ocarina without pausing uh, the game and going into the menu selection. Another gold sculpture token. Well, may as well get it. So now I got 11. Just dandy. So yeah, we got the ocarina now. All right, so we're over at the entrance of Dodongo's Cavern again. Oh, and I also need to uh, re-equip uh, the Hylian Shield because... Oh, come on. I meant to target the enemy. Okay, uh... Okay. I was afraid of that, and also that I was 
Oh, come on. It looks like I'm gonna have to kill the enemy first. All right, there we go. Now to get this key. You found a small key for the Gerudo training ground. That I did. Oh, and the chicken hatch. Well, at least now, whenever I get to Hyrule Castle, I will have that chicken ready. All right. Well, I'm gonna throw these rocks and get the hearts. You know, to stock up on my health. And now, I'm gonna be entering Dodongo's Cavern. Or re-entering it. And I'm going to open up the eyes. You know, I could maybe actually wait until I'm Adult Link to do this. But you know what, while I'm here, may as well do it now because... You know, it's one of the things that I can do at this moment. Although, it probably could... Actually, I'm gonna see what other items I could get if I just go ahead and, uh... You know... I think that I may actually just come back here as Adult Link. Because, you know... I already beat a boss in this uh, episode, so I may as well just save getting uh, getting King Dodongo for the next episode. I'm gonna check to see if uh, the death. No, I don't think it. I don't think that gate is open. I'm pretty sure that it isn't open. All right, so here I am in Hyrule Field. And I think that, maybe to end off the episode, I'll just go to the House of Sculptula and get the reward uh, for getting all of the, uh, the gold Sculptulas. You know, for some reason, I have just now noticed an image that looks like a, uh, you know, like a brick. You know, like a Lego brick up at the top left corner of the screen. I'm not sure what that is, and I don't know if it's been there uh, the whole time, and I've just never noticed it before. Like, I have no idea what that- oh wait, it disappeared. Okay, it disappeared. So maybe it was just there for a certain while. So, the <laughs> so Kakariko Village's music is the Lon Lon Ranch music. This is actually very fitting. This is very good. Randomized music. Okay, let me, uh... Oh, I guess it needs to be nighttime for the Sculptula to fall down. Okay, so... Gonna go into the Sculptula house now. And see what we got. Alright! Oh, didn't mean to... Get the sword out. All right, so what's the price? Another gold sculpture token, as if we haven't had enough of those. And the music stopped again. Just dandy. Okay, well, I think that I'm gonna call it an episode. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you again in the next episode.